where it's going to end. Um, you know, first she had gastroenteritis, writers, and then they said she had chicken pox. And then it wasn't chicken pox, and it was this rash that would just disappear, which it kind of has. We get the odd one. But this rash on her face, it's behind her ears, it's on her ears, um, on her neck, right underneath her chin. I just don't know what it is and oh, I just want an answer and I just feel so sorry for her. I mean, she's finding herself happy as Larry but it's just upsetting to see her like it because her face is quite, quite red and, and quite spotty and it's just upsetting to see. She's asleep on me at the moment which is why I'm, I'm whispering. I just feel really low over it. You know, it's just, it's just upsetting. It's, you know, she's not even one yet. We're not even celebrating her first birthday and it's just not fair. You know, I don't know what, what it is. Um, oh, I don't know. But I need to find out. Because it's just not fair on, on her. And we just want to know. So she's asleep at the moment. But I don't know if you can really see. But in certain lights, her face looks so, so red, bless her.
Hi, so just come out of the doctors and um, they they still don't know what it is. Basically, they think it's a rash that will kind of disappear on its own. It's obviously some sort of viral rash, but they can't put a name to it. She said it's not measles, it's not German measles, it's not meningitis, it's nothing like that. Um, it does look like it will just disappear on its own. Um, I don't know what the answer is basically, just I haven't got words I and mean, she is fine but it doesn't stop you worrying as a parent and they're saying to me oh if she gets your temperature that's fine if the rash is irritating her give her some Pyrotom um, if her whole demeanour changes then that's something to, to look at but for now they think it's just something that will will disappear I don't know I don't know what the answer is I should be happy because she hasn't got any of them things that we said but I don't know it's just difficult isn't it anyway we were meant to be going to musical playtime this morning, but um, I'm going to give it a miss, just for obvious reasons. I don't feel like it. I feel really, really crappy. Um, and not that it is anything to worry about, but um, I, think, I think it's best to just keep her away from other children. I wouldn't want to... Um, potentially give them something else that's just not fair um, and the doctor also said that I shouldn't be around any pregnant women well to my knowledge nobody that I know is pregnant but it's not the kind of question you can go asking um, so it's probably best to just avoid kind of that kind of thing so good morning happy but um we're gonna go home now. She can have a play. She can have a little snack and a play, and um, just kind of relax, basically. Hey, bunny. Hey, bunny. Are you enjoying a biscotti? Are you? Are you enjoying a biscotti? Say, I'm so tired. I'm so tired. I didn't sleep much at all last night. No, I did. No. <laughs> Are you playing with the camera? Yes. Are you talking to them? Say hello, everybody. Yes. Hello. 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 Yes.
Hello everybody. Hi. So I'm really enjoying my gingerbread biscotti. It's very nice. Families are the best, aren't they? You don't know what you'd do without them. Sorry, I don't mean to get soppy. But they are. They are the best. One thing I'm definitely, definitely doing when Malone has her nap, I am washing my hair and my skin. I don't know what's happened to it. I spent ages painting my nails as well on Tuesday evening. It's all come off. I don't understand how you can use a decent base coat, then a nail polish and then a decent top coat and I it was peeling by the next morning. I don't quite understand. But that's my job to find a decent top coat or base coat, whatever one is the one that makes it stick. Because it was silly. Complete waste of time doing it. Stayed on the toes, but not on your fingers. So that is annoying. Isn't it? Look at the mess you're making. Look at your hands. Look at the state of them hands. Is that nice? Are you poking your tongue out? Oh, you. You're so cheeky. You're so cheeky. That's the noises you make. Mm. Mm, it is. I spotted the tiniest, tiniest frog. He's down here. I don't know if you're going to be able to see because of the sun. He's there. He's so tiny. Just here. Look. He's so small. He's so dinky. Hi, mister. So tiny. Hello. Then we've got squirting the turkey down here. What are you up to, monkey? It's a bit too hot out here, really, to have you out here. Because I can feel that sun on my back already. We've literally just walked out here. <coughs> Malone loves the fish pond. Talking to the fish. The fish whisperer. The fish jabberer. You see them fish? Weed's cleaning out, the sun gets to it and it creates all this algae. If I have, they're in the box. Uh, in that get bag, actually. What are you doing, Malone? Are you climbing up the stairs? Are you climbing up the stairs? I don't really like Malone doing this. Hmm, I'm doing something with the leg. Are we coming back down? Are you coming back down? No, I'm going up. Careful. Daddy's rubbing down the door. it is being painted. What is that? 
quite got no joke. What are you doing with that? Filling the little gaps. Ah, oh, filling the gaps. Yeah, our door was a hideous colour before. Um, um, it's now being done in a Farrell and Ball green. But uh, it has to have all the prep work done to it before it gets done. There's a baby on the stairs that's been a bit of a daredevil. Come on, monkey. And in the bottom step. Clinging on for dear life. Dad wants a J cloth. Whoa. At some point we'd like to do our hole, but it'll have to wait. There's quite a few other jobs we need to get done. So yeah, paint our front door. And the porch was the same, it's like a hideous colour. And now it's been done. So hopefully it'll be done before the party. Honestly, babies do know do not know what to get up to. I've, I'm literally making Malone a bottle, so I've opened the cupboard and she's coming in as quick as like you like and now raiding the cupboard. I mean seriously. What you like, Lo? Hey? What you like? Whatever man, let me get on with it. Hey! Trouble makes trouble, trouble looks for me. That's what you are. Meeting some of these pink wafers. Remember these as a kid? Yeah. All right, it doesn't taste too bad. All right, make a hell of a lot of mess though. Look at that. Hell of a lot of mess. Hey, excuse me, squirt. Hello. Just made myself a cup of tea. Come on. Let's come out of the kitchen now. Yeah? We need to put all this next to the drainer because it's got to be washed up, hasn't it? Can't go using it because you've had it on the floor. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on. Malone seems to be going, going through some sort of phase at the moment where she doesn't want to sleep. I um, don't know if it's because of her rash or she's going through some sleep regression or I'm not entirely sure. But uh, Malone is sitting on Dean with my phone watching Peppa Pig. When it finishes she just throws it as if to say, next episode please Dad. Don't you alone? Yeah, I'm talking about you. Sorry. <gasps> okay. Peppa Pig. Hello. <laughs> Face plant. Hello. Uh... Listen, sir, this is where you work. Now. We are highly effective. Thanks, highly Dad. Dad. Commendation. <laughs> Commendation. That's <laughs> yes, true. Okay. Can I help you? Okay. It's. Bless we're, we're still, uh, we're still good. We're still alive. It you know the sprinklers still on, do you? It could be yeah. worse, right? Much, much worse. You, you'd forgotten, hadn't you? <laughs> So cute. Yeah. 
Dessa. Plessa. I've had two apples, thank you very much. Come here, I'm doing the tea. Yeah. Look how sweet she is. Look at that little face. She's just so sweet. Look at that big fat belly. She's a proper little polka, isn't she? Look at that big fat belly. <laughs> <laughs>